I'm just tired. Welcome to today's vlog. Yeah, I tried let me attempt like a weekly vlog kind of video because my days are a little bit different every day, and I guess the week will make it more entertaining or you know, it make me have a, a bit of content. It's this. <laughs> Why are you waking up so much in the night? Hmm? Why? Why are you waking up so much in the night? Watching your child grow because he has learned to move forward. Check this out, like he has actually learned. So I registered Sinobi in swimming classes, which are supposed to start today. So I'm just trying to pack his his bag, like his diaper bag. Guys, you know that there was um, pampers for <laughs> there was diapers for swimming, like swimming diapers. I never knew. Just take my hand. You, you, as a young So I hear. Um, I just look like a teacher. Yeah. So yeah, I'm just going to head over there right now. And see what they are saying. Actually, let me try and tie this hair some in a different way. Yeah, so this is much better. back and to be very honest my son did not really enjoy that i don't know he wasn't as happy as he is like when he swims or takes a shower or is in the water he was just not himself i don't know what it was maybe i don't know maybe the crowd was too much but i'm supposed to continue tomorrow so i'll try again tomorrow but i wasn't encouraged to go back to be honest because it up maybe it's something he needs to get used to yeah but right now i'm so tired i don't know that swimming makes you so tired i am so tired that i need to find something to eat Today is the next day. Every day, I try my best to clean this house, organize my space, but it seems like it just gets scattered. And every morning, I have to do the same thing again. No, I, just, I guess I have to do it quickly before Sinobi wakes up. guys at least i've cleared up a bit and yeah yesterday is night yesterday night was it wasn't too bad Sinobi didn't wake up like five times he woke up about three times which was a, an improvement compared to the past three weeks um but so right now we are running late let me just pack up his bag for today Yeah, so um, 
Yeah, um, I just made his food because I know he'll wake up and he'll be hungry. Honestly, I wasn't ginger to go to the, to the swimming lessons because they did not really teach us how to paddle or do anything. They just thought, we just played some nursery, we just sang some nursery rhymes and then played with their feet. But I'm hoping that maybe that is like a primer before we get started. And again, he didn't really like the water, so he kept holding me so tight, so I wasn't encouraged. But Udoka said I should go again today, and you know, I should just keep up. Maybe some children are like that, so. Do you like your new swimsuit? Do you like your new swimsuit? I hope this one will not fall off in the water. No tight. I know sometimes life can be tough. He cleaned his mouth off camera. And honestly, you guys, um, I've been struggling because most times, I don't know, he doesn't like to open his mouth. He knows when I'm about to clean it and then he just tightens his jaw. If you remember, I complained about him not taking solids and him not being as enthusiastic as I thought he would be, you know, but yesterday he actually finished his food and I guess that I'm just learning now that he doesn't have to eat the whole bowl. Like when, he st when your child is starting winning for the first time, one or two, um, three or four spoons is, is a good start for them and um, yesterday he finished his food. It was very little but he finished it which is an improvement baby congrats you finished your food yesterday congratulations my baby <laughs> oh congratulations for eating anyways you guys out it's time to go and i would switch over to my phone i might not even do i might not be able to do any videos in the pool area because you know there's a lot of privacy people are naked and whatnot so yeah but yeah we're going right now so I'll see you guys later. Always carrying that all so heavy load. We're done. Um, just going to go home now. Uh, so today he was a lot better. At least he he decided to play with toys today, and you know, decided to participate. So yeah, I think the problem is that the water is a bit cold for him. But hopefully. He, he gets a hang of it. I'll do some research on it and see how well he'll get used to the whatever. Hey guys, so I'm back home and um, yeah, I don't know why is it that whenever I come back from this swimming pool, I'm always like so tired, like it's as if I carry block. Sinobi himself has gone to sleep now, but I'm so tired and um. Like when he sleeps, I feel like that's the time I have to do things around the house. But right now, I'm very tired. Like I don't have the energy to do anything. Like honestly, I don't have the energy to do anything. But I feel like my spirit wants to do something. And then my other spirit of mine is saying I should just go and sleep and regain my energy. I'm not sure what to do yeah you guys um honestly it's been difficult to i won't lie like i look at myself sometimes and i don't like how i look i don't like how i feel i feel like i don't know how to explain it i just don't feel as like i feel like i'm not myself i feel like i've not been myself like there was a time when i was getting into a routine with sinobi but like now i feel like i'm just out of sorts i'm not i'm out of a routine i don't i'm not sure what it is i'm not in a routine with him i cannot walk out in the morning like i can't do so many things that i usually used to do and it's really making me upset like my entire body is tired like my entire body is really tired sometimes i don't even have the energy to wash my face in the night like i'm that tired so yeah hopefully it gets better hopefully it gets better soon um yeah i don't know i want her to chill out here because you know when he's awake 
I can't fully relax because my mind and everything I do is always, you know, I'm always thinking about him, looking out for him. But right now, I'm so tired that anything I decide to do, I'm not sure I'll enjoy it well. So I might as well just go and sleep with him and probably wake up when he wakes up. I feel when I sleep, I'll be more rejuvenated. You just had enough. So I just want to quickly go down the road and get some things. I'm just craving what I don't know. Um, there's this guy that did like a salmon cream sauce. I've never actually made a cream sauce before. So I want to try it out. The weather is hot. The weather is what? Oku. Only one oku. Eh? Yeah. Next year, next year, this is testimony. Hello, 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 this year, next year. Mm -hmm. Usually, I don't post. Usually, I don't post, but I want the world to know. I'm looking for all purple seasoning. I thought that they would have it in the in bulk bag, but for some reason, they don't have it. So, I'm just going to save on foods now. Hopefully they have what I'm looking for because I don't want to walk around too much. This boy is heavy. But I wanna be bold with it. Don't care who we told about it. Well baby got a hold on it. Love on for tonight. Don't be calling us go. No lie, so fair with it. Go let him stare at it. Now I'm prepared. Oh, we just said a love out loud since we ain't going over. So tonight. But I want the world to know I'm a good catch But I never let him catch me No, I never let him play me Wild thing, try to take me But you got my mood on sunshine Let's take a trip I'm back And I'm with this young man So I had to shower him let me put this camera in a place where you can see me well. So I had to shower him and shower myself. Throughout when I was making that food, could you hear him? He was crying like someone that they abandoned 10 years ago. So I had to shower him and give him food. Me, I've not eaten no. Nah. Bobo. Dada, I've not eaten since morning. I took you swimming, took you every, every. Hmm? Will you stay? Let me eat. Please, I wanted to have this moment to myself. I've been trying to make him sleep. Like, I've tried my best to make him sleep. I've done, I've pulled out all the stops, all the tricks that usually get this young man to sleep. But he has refused to sleep because I wanted to enjoy myself, watch some vlogs, watch one or two episodes of two doors that I've started watching again. Give me. Usually, I don't pose. <laughs> But I want the world to know Time to pull a drop top out Summer nights, it's a vibe, yeah We've been keeping it in the house Netflix and chilling, I GDM in, yeah Didn't wanna share my love Till I found someone I'm sure of Young and untamed I've been out of range Keeping it low, but I wanna Oh my Mommy, yeah, you made a permanent home in my head. You moving like a goddess, come my way, my way, my way. I actually feel a little, I don't know, I feel a little groggy. Is groggy the word? That alcohol I put in that my pasta. Are you sure the thing did not? Was it the thing activated? Because. 
I feel a little like somebody that is a little hungover, which is funny. That small alcohol that I cooked in that pasta is what is giving me, making me feel like this. Ah, actually, I forgot that I poured small in cup, but I didn't even end up drinking it. I think I, I, I is in the sink there. It's in the sink. Anyways, yeah, you people, I've not been feeling like myself. <sighs> Yeah, I've not really been feeling like myself. I've not been feeling like Luta. I'm even scared to check the weight to see how much I weigh now. It makes me so sad. I know I need to check it every time so that I'll be motivated. But I really don't feel myself. Like I feel so stressed. I feel like I need to handle my stress first before I can think of going back on any diet or weight loss or anything. Like I'm not happy about it really. It's making me sad. But I feel like when I start driving, it would be better. And I've just been stalling on this driving issue. But I have got to start. I'm trying to take my test on Saturday. So I hope, you know, that would, that would help me. That should help me. I think I need some music to just lighten up the mood. <sighs> Oh. My sons, my son's fingernails are so sharp. Like they are so sharp. So you know, you need to cut your nails now. And when you're trying to cut the nails, this boy will be fighting you as if he's using the nail to do something. You are going to cut it right now. Time goes by and yet I wonder. Are you and me still the same? Are you still loving the game? I know I don't. You cast your spell and I went under I know the laughter and the pain Will I ever love again? I don't know if I can take it anymore uh -huh. So I stay here and hold my heart when you walk out the door uh -huh. Made a promise to myself I had to bag this boy because he was just not letting me hear word. He was just crying. I even left the food I was eating. Guys, I'm I'm so tired. I don't know. I woke up but I feel sleepy. Hmm? He wants me to walk around so that he will sleep, I guess. I mean myself, I want someone to carry me and walk around. Today is Sinobi's vaccination, so I guess I have to be nice to him. I have to be very nice to him because he's going to get shot. Has he slept? Honestly, if motherhood does not humble you, like, see how I, I don't believe, I look, I look very, I don't know the word, I look like, I'm going through a lot. My entire body is paining me. Yeah, I just believe that I used to be a babe and I will go back to being a babe in a few months in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Because this, this motherhood can, can really humble you. I mean, come and get ready for the vaccination. I think I have at least one hour to chill before then. We're twisting, we're twisting, we're twisting. Now we stop jumping, we're jumping. Now we stop. Distracted, so I can still some minutes to shower. Yeah, which I'll just quickly do. I 
son is just shouting as if I, I abandoned him. Just shouting as if I've des deserted him in this world. The leg, so the muscle of the leg, we're going to hold him. Um, if you don't mind actually having him sit on your lap. There, there we go. And yeah, have that tuck into your back as you're giving a hug. There you go. He kicks a lot, right? Yeah. And then just hold that, and then hold this leg, and tuck your... Hey. Oh. Okay. This? Yeah. There we go. There we go. Wait. Uh, Toot. That... No, no, I'm oh, talking to him. Okay. I'm trying to distract him. You're just trying to distract him? Awesome. I can't even look. <laughs> you don't have to look if you don't want to look. Mm -hmm. we're back and Sinobi is sleeping um, so that is good news I am just warming up what I will eat in the microwave and that's what I made yesterday night that's the salmon pasta stuff Sometimes life can be tough And you feel like you just had enough When you're thinking everything is gone wrong Just remember that I I wanna pick you up from the ground Let you know that I'm always around hey guys, I know Good morning um, Yeah, so today is Today is Thursday and Honestly, I don't know how this vlog is going cause So, yeah, today I decided that I want to make moi moi Just because when I think of healthy foods to eat, salad doesn't come to my mind and moi moi seems like the healthiest option. So I went to Bulk and I bought white beans, but it's seeming very hard. Tell me why Nigerian beans is easy to peel. Like this is seeming, it's seeming so hard to peel these beans. Like and usually you know you don't really soak, you don't need to soak moi moi, you don't need to soak beans to 
to remove the skin it's actually easier when you just put it and remove the skin but the skin wasn't budging at all so that's why i had to soak it it's, it has started to come off but it's not coming off today is swimming lessons again i have the lessons go on for 10 days um we missed yesterday because he went for his immunization uh, so today i'm supposed to continue hopefully it's better but honestly you guys going out every day i think that's why i'm very stressed that's why my schedule is out of sorts um i want to go back get back into doing home workouts and everything but to be very honest with you right now i feel like I, I feel like when you're trying to lose weight here, you need to deal with stress. If you're stressed, everything will work against you. So I feel like I need to sleep well and be stress-free first before I can plan a schedule for weight loss and be more motivated for weight loss. Because I don't feel myself. I don't. I feel like shit right now, to be very honest. Um, yeah, so hopefully this moment moment will help things because after eating that my second round of delicious salmon creamy sauce with my pasta, the guilt I started to feel guilty for eating that much carbs and um stuff, but it felt good to eat it. I'm supposed to have slept well yesterday, but my coconut hair decided to edit while Sinobi slept because he actually slept around nine so from our discussion with the doctor the doctor asked me if everything was going well how his sleeping was and i let her know that he was waking up like six times in the night and she told me to that i need to have a routine a nighttime routine so you people before i got pregnant before i had this baby when i see all these things like nighttime routine for babies i used to think that these oyibo people or these people these vloggers were just capping or they were they're just being extra but actually there's a need for nighttime routine i don't really have one as it is right now we actually just go with the flow but i think it would be better if we know that by eight o'clock this guy has slept he's eating he's slept so i'm going to try and develop a routine most times i'm actually so tired to give him a shower because when, when I, whenever you, i bath him he sleeps better he sleeps faster but for my mental health and for the sake of my mind like i need to do that because i know that some people when they get pregnant after they have a baby that's when their bp starts to go high and my bp has always been normal i don't want it to change so i have a bp machine that i just bought but hopefully i'll never have to consistently use it and these are the times when i need to curb this bp issue because you people it is real so anyways you people let me try and wash up my beans. I'll probably see you guys later. I know sometimes life can be tough. Hi guys, so yes, here um here for lessons with my sweet boy. Say hello baby. Hi my baby. So I'm uh, here and I'm excited because today I think that He's a little bit. So he's more active, so I'm hoping I'm hoping he'll be as active as this in the water. Hopefully, by the special grace of God Almighty. But yeah, so off we go. Where are you going to now? Yeah, let's go. Yes. So, guys i'm back so i'm back for today i'm so hungry i had to quickly stop at dollarama to buy to buy things for the moi moi the container for the moi moi and i got popcorn because i like to snack and i realized that um salt popcorn is a healthier way to snack don't ever go to the mall mm, to buy food stock when you're hungry i had not eaten trial today I went for that swimming and I feel like I carried block so I was tempted to buy all the sugar sugar things there I needed some I needed sugar though to quench my hunger because my hands were beginning to shake so I just got like sesame seed snacks 
that was what I ate. I came back, back home, I was going to drink complex to form that I'm doing healthy. But I just reminded myself that when you're doing what on a diet, you need to eat. So if I eat breakfast well, lunch well, dinner well, I'm not sure I'll be having cravings for rubbish. So I'm trying my best to people, but I'm 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 I'm, I'm actually struggling with this. <coughs> so it's my beans and my gary. Oh, there you go. Maybe a while, so and I'm just eating, so there's nothing to really vlog, so I'll see you later. Yeah, I had to back you know, because I wanted to quickly complete my mama, which I have blended now. Get you a powerful blender like this. Um, Always so hard. Eh? Somebody will bring, will, will see you carrying mortar and pistol to Canada. They will think you want to be making pound a jam. They will not know you want to just be to pound Maggie because the Maggie is so hard. Today is Friday. Your nose. I've been awake since I won't lie. I just thought do I even want to vlog today or not? And I decided to give the people what the people want. So here I am with my camera and my baby. Usually I wake up before him and I woke up before him. I was editing some videos, so there's really nothing to vlog. But yeah. I slept very well yesterday night, like, I slept so well. Um, Sinobi did not wake up too much, or even if he did, I think I went to bed on time. So I'm feeling more like myself. Um, maybe if I sleep well again tomorrow, I'll start working out. I need to basically discipline myself. I need to discipline him as well. I need to go to bed on time, not when it's late, like 2 a.m. or something, because I want a long time. I need to prioritize my mental health and my health basically but you guys this morning i woke up and when Sinobi woke up um he didn't cry which was the first i woke up and i went to the room and i saw that he was just smiling so hi guys so swimming classes are over and Sinobi wanted to kill me with cry because he was very hungry but today i'll say we came really late but he did really better i feel like when he's they put on they made them put on their life jackets today and he was able i was able to see him try and make some movement with his um his legs and then he smiled and laughed in the water which is normal him when we're having a bad bad time so yeah i would say today is better i guess it gets better with time um he's still really really small so hopefully it will truly truly get better oh well, yeah So today is Saturday and I'm finally getting the hang of this vlogging, this vlogging experience. I'm actually now, I'm just now getting the hang of it. Honestly, when I said I was going to vlog for a whole week, I did not know that I would 
have anything to vlog about. In fact, I don't think I've really had much to show you people other than my boring life as a mom and how I'm trying to handle this my new reality. But yeah, you guys, I have decided, so yesterday night, I decided to take charge of my life. I love my baby. I want the best for him, but I need to pour from, I cannot pour from an empty cup. And when I feel like he's on my body 247, I feel like I can't give him much. I need to be able to give him my full self. I need to be able to feel like myself while parenting. So I, if you know me, I'm an accountant. I, I, I count and I calculate all my money very well. But yesterday, or this morning, I just, you know, sometimes when the necessity hits you, bam, you just spend the money that you've been thinking you don't need to spend. So, yes, I have ordered a play pen. I checked everywhere, like I wanted to get the best deal. I, you know, normal, normal before I make a purchase, normally I, I, I ruminate over it for like two, three days, four days, five days, one week, two weeks before I decide to make the purchase. But it's so necessary for me right now because Sinobi is moving around a lot. He's getting his hands into places that they don't have any business being. And I remember when I used to complain about when he couldn't even move, that I couldn't leave him alone. And my auntie would tell me, leave him, let him cry. He would develop his lungs and do what you need to do. And I always felt like I needed to have him on me. I now miss those days because right now he's moving around so it's not even about hearing him cry that would distress me that one is moi moi right now right now i'm worried about him getting injured i'm worried about him being in places that he doesn't need to be or getting falling down or i'm like my mind goes to everywhere like i have other baby proofing things i just don't know why it has not arrived I have other things to baby proof this house and then I decided to get a play pen. So a play pen, if you don't know what I mean, is like a play area. You know, I have a mat in the sitting room. It's like a play area that has like doors made of nets so that your baby can play in it and then you can do other things. And because you know that there's a confined space, you can put toys and stuff in that space so that he doesn't um get his hands into places that he have no business being. So uh, my sitting room is quite small as you know but um, it's a sacrifice that needs to be made so we're going to make it work i've been measuring with my measuring tape trying to know the dimensions and stuff but i just finally just closed my eyes and ordered it and they said it will come tomorrow i hope amazon or kono say not tomorrow kada thing abia it should better come tomorrow because that's why i'm paying for prime because I bought, I got Prime when I was pregnant, when I was just ordering, ordering, ordering stuff of Amazon. Because I needed them like the next day, next day. And I just forgot to cancel. So, right now, you say I'm, I'm, I'm using Amazon Prime, right? It better come tomorrow because I need it ASAP. Anyways, you guys, today is Igbo traditional day in Lethbridge here. It's the first one that they are doing something like this. Everybody is bringing something. And like I said before, I might have mentioned that I decided to bring fruits, um, water, and coleslaw. That's my contribution. I'm, I've contributed, but I'm excited for today. I'm always excited to go anywhere. Like, anywhere. If there was Igbo Day in Lagos, trust me, you will never see my spirit or my shadow there. But right now, I'm excited to go just because meet new people and being in Canada, it's about community. And um, I'm on the group chat and there's actually a lot of good people. There are a lot of networks that might, that are important that, to make on there. So yeah, I'm excited to go. Um, something else, you guys. I'm doing my driving test today. I've been practicing and practicing and practicing and anxiety won't finish me. But this driving test, I've, I'm, going to, I'm going to ace it. I am going to ace it. I have decided that I'm going to ace it. I've been practicing and I was supposed to actually go last week, but what happened? By the time I was ready, they had closed. So I decided that this Saturday, that in fact in a few minutes or a few hours, I'll be going for that. 
hopefully god help me i just get my class seven my, my class five license no my class seven license so that i can begin to take myself places and stop spending money on uber or begging people to take me to places so yes um yeah i'll fix you guys in a bit i guess You probably know that I'm a joker, right? Hey! So you are saying hello to the latest, latest for seven driver. I have my driving, I passed my driving test, I aced it. So I'm gonna start driving. She's gonna start driving. Yes, you people, I went, I took my test, and I passed. So, like I said, we're going for Igbo Day today. I want to cut up my watermelons. Time goes by and yet I wonder Are you and me still the same? Are you still loving the game? I know I don't You cast your spell and I went under I know the laughter and the pain Will I ever love again? I don't know if I again take it anymore so I'm ready. This is my signature dress. If you know me, you know that you've seen me on this dress several. So yeah, we're ready and I'll see you guys there because I'm really running late. <laughs> hi guys good morning so today is sunday oh, yeah this is better um yeah today is sunday and we are going to church yeah. and sinobi's playpen is coming today yeah. so hopefully set that up let yeah. me show you guys my outfits because my black battery is blue Today is Monday again and I'm officially ending this vlog today because I'm supposed to, to start a new vlog today but yeah um, I forgot to show you guys what um, I, did, I didn't even vlog trials yesterday again but honestly I was tired and I was worried that this vlog was going to be so long new vlog but you people I, I want to hear you sing the song. Let me drop this camera first. I need to hear you sing with me. Sing with me. Freedom is coming tomorrow. 
get ready, mama, prepare for your freedom. Freedom is coming tomorrow. I know you will know why I'm singing this, my freedom song. So you know that I mentioned that. Um, I got a play pen and my Amazon Prime, it has to show that it's working. So I received my package yesterday. As we were just coming back from church, they had dropped it in front of the door. Hey, I was so happy. So yesterday night, my husband actually um, set it up, put everything together. And, you know, I'll show you what it looks like now. I didn't take any video or anything, but I'm so happy. My apartment is small. My, my sitting room is small. But look at the space it's occupying. Like, I have a safe play space for Sinobi. I, I even put this inside. In fact, I don't think it makes my pallor neater. Because now, I just know that he's here. I don't have to be worried about whether his hands are inside the, the ventilator or the heater or he's going towards the fan. He can even... He even came with these little balls. He came with these little balls. This one I have, I brought this one from Nigeria. Um, I, and I have this mat here, as you might tell, the, it has different sides. It came with this thing where you can use to pull yourself up, like if you're trying to stand. You people, I'm so happy. Like, see, it takes up a, a significant portion of my sitting room, but Omo, I don't care. I'm happy. But how will you know that we have a child if you cannot see evidence that you know this is what he's doing occupying here? I'm, I'm looking forward to this week now because I feel like I can get some things done for myself. Like I can apply for jobs. I can decide to edit and put out content. You people, I have like three videos that I haven't put out. Because I don't have time. Even when I back him, I can't sit down to do it. So, yes, you people, I'm very, very happy. I'm proud. I hope he likes it. Like, um, so you will have to watch my next vlog to know whether or not Sinobi likes this. But yes, so I am checking out now. I'll see you guys later. Make sure you watch my next vlogs. Make sure you watch my other videos. I'll see you people in them. Um, so yeah. <laughs> um so yeah let me clear this room up that's what you'll see in the next vlog i'll see you guys later love you thanks for watching bye